what's up y'all and welcome back to the channel and today as you can see I got a bunch of blind bags behind me but chill out it's not a review video I've already done reviews on pretty much every one of these bags except for this one this is one I've never done a review on um, I actually got this bag about this time last year didn't do a review on it I kind of wanted to use it a little bit before I did it and I used it all the way through teal season last year and quickly found out that it was it was not the bag for me it was not what I was looking for <laughs> and if you're a follower of this channel then you know I have been through bag after bag after bag trying to find the right blind bag or walk-in bag for me that fits me and my needs now I know what you're thinking why have you had to get so many bags you know they all do pretty much the same thing and that's true but with filming and carrying camera gear along with calls and shells and everything else that I carry in my bag I just needed something that was comfortable that had enough space and you know it, it just fit me and my style of hunting something that when I got, got set up in a layout blind or in my Invisiman or whatever it may be that was just not a burden like what was I going to do with it where could I put it I mean it was just I, I, I'm a little OCD when it comes to bags you know <laughs> But that's just me, and, and that's okay. I know what I like, and I knew what I was looking for. I just had to find the one that, that fit the best. And I did. I found that, And but this is not a review video. That video will come up later, um, and we'll talk about the bag that I finally found. And I used it all last season, and I, 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 it's it. It is the bag for me. Um, but anyway, so these bags. So I've got all these bags that I've used in my trial and error process minus one i'm missing one bag um the cupped waterfowl backpack i had i used it for almost a whole season well, about half a season i guess and i really thought that was the bag for me and uh it, it, and it was close but anyway k took that bag he claimed that bag as his walk-in bag so it's not up here but i've got these four bags now what i've got behind me is i've got the dr duck fly zone backpack I've got the Tangle Free, uh, I think it's the dual, swim, um, dual spinning wing decoy. It'll hold two spinning wing decoys. It's got pockets all over the side of it. I was going to use it to carry everything. You know, I was going to use it for a blind bag, carry spinners, what have you. Or if I didn't want to use spinners at all, it has, it's got plenty of pockets, plenty of room to, to be a multi-purpose bag. Below it is the Drake, I think it's called the Walk-In. 2.0 or walk-in backpack 2.0 um, this bag is a really really nice bag but it, it just it just didn't work for me it's really really big um, like I said not a product review but it's just a really big bag it's a really nice bag I used it during teal season and I could tell right off the bat nope not for me and then behind me right here this is the Rogers uh, I think they call it the two-in-one spinning wing decoy bag something like that it, it opens up and it's got a divider in it it'll actually hold two spinning wing decoys and on the sides it's got places for your spinning wing poles and then a couple pockets down here but anyway i've done reviews on all of these bags except for the drake walk-in 2.0 if you'd like to check out this um fly zone backpack in a little bit further detail as far as like a review um i'll drop a card up here at the top of the screen just touch that little thing to slid across a little eye symbol check out that video um, and then these two the Rogers bag and the Tangle Free bag I did a comparison video featuring these two bags at the same time in the same video and uh, you can check that out up here at the top of the screen as well but I'm getting rid of these bags this is kind of like a, a, a duck bag garage sale for the lack of better words I got all this stuff it's just sitting in my way I'm tired of moving it around it's out here in my office and my back in the gear room and it's just sitting there and I'm tired of it just sitting there and having to move it around when I do this and do that it's collecting dust and some of them are dirty they've been used a good bit and I'll clean them up best I can um, but what I'm thinking is like this bag right here um, is about two years old and it was like 270 something 280 dollars roughly for this bag this one was well over a hundred this one I think was right at a hundred maybe maybe a little more I can't remember and this one was well over a hundred dollars this Drake bag 
I'm going to sell all these bags for $50 a piece. If you would like to get one of these bags, drop a comment down below and um, let me know which one you want. I'm not going to charge any shipping, just $50 and I ship it to you. But you'll have to um, contact me by email and, uh, you know, to, you know, get everything squared away as far as your, your name, your shipping address, that type of thing. And I'm going to be accepting Venmo. Um, so that's how we're going to do the, the payment process is through Venmo. So if you'd like to have these bags, this is a good deal. I don't think they even make this bag anymore. They, Dr. Duck Dutton, they've got a, they've upgraded, they've changed their design a little bit. This is a really sweet bag. I used this bag for a, a long time and I liked it. Um, almost two whole, oh well, yeah, almost two whole seasons I used this bag. And I really, really thought it was for me. And I used it up until I found the bag that I used this past season. And then, yeah, that was the, that was the deal breaker. But had I not found the bag that I, I'm currently using, that would still be my bag. But my buddy Jake from Chasing Green, I know y'all know Jake. If you've ever seen the Chasing Green channel, um, he and I are really good friends. This Drake Walk-In 2.0 backpack is the bag he uses. He loves it. He hauls a lot of stuff. A lot more than me. His bag light weighs 150 pounds. I swear it's miserable. I don't know how he does it. I don't know what he's got in there. But it's heavy. And uh, that's the bag he uses. And um, I know Josh from um, Outdoor Limits, he used to use this Rogers um, spinning wing decoy bag. The dual, dual bag. He used to use it. I don't know if he's currently still using that or not. I did talk to him. Run into him on a trip this past year. And uh, he was actually using it then, so I don't know if that's what he uses all the time, or if he, or if he fluctuates depending on you know what he's hunting in, whether it be the kayak, the big boat, walk in. I don't know. And um, this Tangle Free bag, uh, I know some other people that use these bags as a back as a backpack, blind bag, and a gear bag as far as the spinning wing thing there. So anyway, like I said, fifty dollars per bag. If you want to check out the review videos, click those links. They'll on back on the screen and uh, click those links that I showed you before. You can kind of go into a little further detail, show you the features of each bag. My plan was to offer it to you guys first. If y'all don't pick them up, I'm going to put them on eBay, you know, and just put a flat rate on it. I'm not going to do a bidding process. Just put $50 on there and they'll stay there, you know, until they're sold. Um, but I got to get rid of them. I got to get them out of my way. I hate to put them in like a garage sale out here in the yard because you don't get anything for them and I'm not trying to get my money back I just know they're very expensive bags and they're all very very nice bags um, they're worth $50 hands down all day long so um, anyway if you'd like to pick up one of these bags drop a comment down below let me know which ones you want and then you're gonna have to contact me by email for um, like I said your shipping information all that and I'm gonna be accepting payment through Venmo so Anyway, I appreciate y'all watching. I hope you pick up a bag. Tell your buddies, tell your friends. If you don't want it, tell somebody who might. Tell them to check out the video. Share this video. Share it on Facebook. Share it on Instagram. Wherever you want to share it. Share it, share it, share it. Copy the link. Post it. Share it wherever you want to. Get the word out. This is a really good deal for somebody who might want one of these bags. I appreciate y'all watching. And that's all I got for you this week, guys. So until next time, y'all bust them up.